Ah, the most famous par five, maybe in all of golf, number 13 at Augusta. You're way back here in this corner. You've got about 270 yards. You get around this little corner here. A lot of guys will take a three wood and stand on the left side of the tee and try to catch that three wood off this hill and get it down here in the fairway. You'll see a lot of guys that are trying to turn it. They'll blow it up in these trees right here. Remember, Phil Mickelson hit that incredible shot out of the trees. Bryson DeJambeau last year was in the trees and went for it and got himself in trouble, made a bogey. And I think even later in the week, Bryson went over the top and was up in this area, which is just ridiculous. But, you know, the tough thing about 13 second shot is, as you can see, all that land is sloping right to left and the difficult thing for me is as, as everyone knows when you play off a side slope that's one thing but when you're off the side slope you've got to aim the ball a little further right so you finish up aiming right here and bringing it back and it's very disconcerting you have a tendency to want to sort of play a fade shot into this green and off a side slope that can cause troubles too so you know, I never thought this hole was very easy. I always, I wasn't, you know, a long, long iron player. So if I hit a great drive around here, I was hoping maybe carrying a five wood or something. But, you know, you, you lay up, you know, if if the pin is, is down here on the left, you lay up high to the right and you play, get some angle. If the pin is back here, you might even chip an iron down into the corner here so you can get an easy pitch up the hill there. So, you know, it's a lot of angles on this course. This week, the greens are going to be firm and and running fast. So we're going to see some guys, uh, you know, get into trouble and they're going to have to play these angles if they're going to continue to score all week.